Let's play Two Point Campus. Oh, we've got to do this, have we? There we go. Let's go on to the... Okay. Did you know, room for facilities need... Okay, I'm Albert Crank, your own personal advisor, and I'm here to help. How are you now? You may not have experience, any experience as a campus administrator, but the people at Firstly County College are eager to give you a chance. I'm not sure what that says about them, but hey, Let's head to Freshly Meadows and get started on your academic empire. This one. This countryside college has low expectations and a nice canal. It's the perfect place to start your career. Starting from $500,000. This countryside network, yeah, I've already read that. A university is not something that one simply opens, like a savings account or a jar of pickles. Any self-respecting academic institution was doubtlessly opened long ago by dignified people who wore bowler hats and spoke via subtitle, The world is a creation of the past, and it is our job to keep it all going and try not to touch anything. Well, I'll see you later then. Welcome to Freshly, Me Freshly Meadows, where life moves slowly and expectations are lowly. The Two Point Countryside is the perfect place to start with your career. Learn the ropes, make mistakes, and hit the ground smiling. Course and pro, Scientography, Student Intake, 10. Okay. Staff are reminded that they're easily replaceable. Welcome to campus. Before you start churning out geniuses, you'll need to learn the basics of campus management. Okay? Try moving the camera and have the look around. Okay, so we're going to be running a scientography course. Let's start building a science lab, okay? So we hit this button, hit that button, and now... Oh, what size has it got to be? Students should report five, five, all five. issues to someone that cares.
One. Sir Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. Welcome to Two Point Radio, <laughs> where it's a great day. Why? Because I, Sir Nigel Bickleworth, am talking into a microphone. Can you feel it? Can oh, you hear me? A teacher now. Is this thing on? Really, Dennis, if this is off the I'm going to come in there to and dunk you like a biscuit. We'll check that I'm on the air great, great, and great, be great. back with more sumptuous sound wave salaciousness after this. When you're ready, so let's start next year to welcome our first year of students. Students should check in before trying to learn. Yes, it's because to know you where they are. The students are arriving on campus. Are you nervous? Why am I nervous? Oh, yeah, they come. Starting in the science lab. their academic level. Oh, 10% plus 10 bonus XP. Okay. Why 
Why is it that the youth of today believe they can churn out a radio show from the comfort of their they toilet did it. seats? They did it. Look all. In my day, we had to work for years, making well. sandwiches Jeez. and polishing Number the communication them. tower Words before they even let you one touch one a microphone. There's more to radios and ability, charm, and a technological literacy. Eager little autodidacts. The lot of them. Be able to focus on their studies in an enthusiastic and cheerful way. Students' needs, such as their thirst or toilet comfort, will affect their overall Students are reminded that you don't have to ask to go to the toilet. Take a look at our students and see what we can do to improve that. Tired. Okay. We're going to put windows. My darling, albeit slack-jawed nephew Kevin, ushered me through cyberspace and into the world of video games. Yes, I played the latest entry in the popular Meat Wizard franchise for Sir Nigel Reviews. I was lost. I was cold. I was scared. The controller was sticky and the subject matter obscene. While I'm unsurprised that it appeals to the desensitized youth of today, I'll tell you what I told that chap in the deli. No one needs that much ham. One magical gem out of a possible five. There you go.
Oh. Janitor needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. School work, oh, social life, exercise, Coward. I just can't do it all. There's Let's only one way to fit everything in. Class. Make your life okay. Jumbo. Jumbo University, be your biggest self. Scientography lecture, starting now. They got two ways the to go news in. and the controversy is surrounding Education Minister Tarquin Foxbridge, who allegedly blew his nose on official government documents. The stories like this are scandalous. It's perfectly clear to me that a group of students have fabricated the images 
somehow. And yet this poor minister faces all manner of backlash and public murmurings. And why? Because he was photographed doing something? I know a witch hunt when I see one. Janitor needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. students do in the next class, okay? one-way affair, this I'm relationship of ours, and that's how it should be. What do you know about radio after all? Almost nothing, I'd imagine. Still, it's time for that rare occasion where we put you, the listener, at the center of things. I am the aunt to ease your agony, the balm to abate what bites you, the A to all your cues. I am listening. Oh, and we're out of time. We'll get to your problems after this, all right? All right. Your 
students have gone from C grade to champs to B grade brain. Let's Frequently asked questions. Sure. I believe that smell is you. So we provide better staff and facilities to improve your students' grades. We make students happy and comfortable to increase their learning rate. We earn more cash by growing the campus and enrolling more students. Congrats if you earned some kudos for completing the objectives. Oh, wee! Now it's going to ask me to spend it. How much could I have? Oh, 230. Helium baboon out there. Whatever. Can't afford that. It's time for Agony Answers with me, Sir Nigel Bickleworth. This week's problem is taxi. from student Felony Bog Dropper, who writes, I've got loads of work but can't concentrate with all the noise in my flat. Well, Felony, I advise that you try a change of scenery. Work in the study, write in the billiard room, mill about oh, in the converted mill, Why, read in the scullery. Okay. Your home is your castle. Okay. Utilize all of its many, many okay. nooks and credits. That's what got me through the hard times. Mm. And we'll get... Yeah, we've got... Uh, now build a staff room. We're going to build a student lounge. We're going to add the two. So we can build a staff room here and it needs to be two by two. It doesn't matter how desperate you are. No urinating on campus facilities. Oh no 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 I'm making money. I thought it was a staff room. Yeah it is, do so I? Okay. Is technically but not socially optional. 
gonna get the shower ready. Right? And that needs to be 2.1. We can be a Do you like what you hear? Of course you do. So why not call in and let our producers know? Recent research suggests that over 97% of our listeners are incidental. That is, hearing by accident rather than intent. Collateral Johnnies, if you will. Nevertheless, I have faith that each radio segment, like a juicy needle in a haystack of filth, is found by someone somewhere. Well done to you. Yeah, I don't Today think he wants to see you naked, mate. Wow. Come on, we're expecting a weed of station on campus. Are we? So reminded that the rain is my fault. Thank the whole way.
janitor needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. Hawthorne and welcome to the show. On my drive in this morning, I was Let's go ahead to it. I was quite tight. <laughs> By a car full of whippersnappers, pipsqueaks, and good for some things. I so, couldn't tell what they were chanting, but it certainly did look like fun. <laughs> so today, only partly because I've got nothing else planned, I thought I'd pay tribute to those young people okay. by telling you a few stories from my glory days. Let's expand our range of courses by starting a virtual normality course.
For those of you who don't know how I spent my formative years, I was born, bred and buttered right here in Two Point County before attending what was then called Two Point um. University. I think it's still called that now, but it was then too. Right, top draw anecdotes coming up, but first, here's another toe tapper. There we go. Are you going to stop him already? When it comes to food, sometimes simple living is happy living. Don't get me wrong, I'm incredibly lucky to eat a wide range of things nowadays, from chicken sandwiches to pastas of seemingly infinite shapes and lengths. But I'll never forget that time at university when I lived off an enormous block of cheddar. I was said to be mostly cheese by the end of term, and you know, I think they were right. Wow. 
it a flipping mercury. I think you need a records cubicle for the library. You students should make a good first impression. No pressure. Oh, it's evil. I'm gonna get that to 250 because I do want. Okay. Where's the light? Oh dear. Oh dear. Just unlock the new campus. But we're going to get to three stars on this one. But for today's episode, we're going to end it here because it's been going on for about 50 minutes. But we're going to get the two extra stars for the next episode. If you would like to see it, like the video if you'd like to see another video of this. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to hit that notification bell if you would like to be notified each and every time I upload. And don't forget to click on all to be notified for all. So thank you guys ever so much for watching this video. Join in the conversation in the comment section below. And I will see you in the next video. Ta-ra for now.